Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First, we'll understand our question. The program must accept the space separated string yes and the integer n and also the n string values and for each string in n string the program must print the words in yes having string as substring in it. So we have also given a note that if there is no such word in yes then we should print minus one so let us consider our first test case so this is our space operator string yes we have four string values so first we'll check for k here k is not present here k is present so we'll have that string then in no other word the case present so let us move to the next word ea so ea is present in learning and ea is not present in any other word then we'll check for ma so it is present here then it is not present here it is present here and it is also present here then we have a after that so a is occurring in most of the words so here we have a here we have a so after that here we have a then also here 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 so we'll print these words so this will be our final output. Let us take our second test case. So here we have the space separated string S yes, and we have five string values. So first we check for O. O is present in programming and after that it is present in this explanatory. Then we'll take AL. So since AL is not present in any of the word, we will print minus one. Then we'll check for I. So it is present in these words and we have it in activity also. Then we'll check for AN. So here it is present and uh, here also, here also it is present so we'll have those words then we have ing so here it is present so we'll have that word and here it is not present here also it is not present so this will be our final output now take our third test case here we have six n string values and first we check for E, so it is present in E enter green and also it is present here. Then we'll have the last string value also. Then we'll check for K I N G, so it is present here. Then we'll check for E N, so it is present here, here. 
then it is also so after that it is not present anywhere then we check for g so g is present in these words then we check for e e r so it is present here then it is also present here after that we have o o o which is not present in any of the string values so we'll print minus 1 so this will be our output now let us implement our program first we'll get the space operator string yes then we'll get the n integer then we'll get the string values using the list comprehension strip of for ctr in range 1 comma n plus 1 then we'll iterate over the string values and check whether it is present in string yes or not so for string sorry for val in string val will have the flag equal to false for that minus one case then for word in yes so we'll write it over the string yes so if val in word then we have to print the word and end argument and also we must change the flag variable to true then if flag is equal to equal to false we have to print minus one and use the end argument and at last we'll have the print in order to move to the next line so let us execute our program with our first test case so here we have got the correct output then we'll take our second test case so here also we have got the correct output so if the word is not there we have also got minus one then we'll pass our third test case so here also we have got the correct output as we discussed in our logic video our program has passed all our given test cases successfully Hope you guys understand. Thanks for watching. See you next video.